Do I have any citizens left? I don't think I do. No. But I should be getting one pretty soon. Three turns. Not sure what I'll be getting next. I might get a leader or another administrator. Prometheon is going to be pretty important actually. Uh, because a lot of the upgrades to the citizens uh, basically require it. So, yeah, I also need Epimetheus Pollen for that, which I actually am lucky to have. So that was good. Right, so I really don't know a lot about these resources and what they do yet. So that's something I'll have to be figuring out coming up. Uh, the survey ship's kind of at the extent of where I can go to. I need to get more constructors out to increase my range. Right. Nothing there. Ah, uh, let's bring that down there, I guess. Okay. Wow, the colony ship's pretty damn good. Uh, seven movements. Don't think it tells you what exactly they've got on it, sadly. Better than mine. Okay. Let's come to there. Minor race, but yeah, can't talk to them. Ever. Right. Uh, what's this? A survey ship? I'm hoping to find relics now. Uh, I think I might get a constructor up there pretty soon actually try to because wow Promethean Thulium definitely gonna want a site there aren't I uh, so what am I getting in here yeah I'll get in a constructor next then get it up to that site right uh, that can go after Capsule. Right. So my money is going to start to come up now. I could even spend it on things like uh, buildings, but buildings are really expensive, so I don't really want to do that. It's asteroids in the main, I need to keep it back for, but. Yeah, there's not an awful lot of asteroids near to my territory, actually. Okay. Oh, uh... Well, this is interesting. Yeah, with the Torians, because we're aquatic, every age we get one of these new amazing any place tile things. Which I'll probably be using all on my capital, but I don't know where yet. There's no point in doing it there because that would be an easy one to get. Uh, you should do it on the ocean tiles, which you otherwise wouldn't be able to get normally. So I'll save it then basically for that. Uh, right, that can make the coal mine, I think. There. That can make the coal mine. Research, right, we got that. Uh, yeah, let's get this then, which is a crappy salvageable thing. I think they get a lot more of these than other races as well, and they're amazing. So, there's one there. Um, one there, is it? Yeah, two, three, four, five. 
six, is it? Oh, maybe six is the normal amount actually. But they'd get, yeah, they get three on top. So one place. Uh, right. I think here then, I'm still waiting. Yeah, w once I get that first one, I'll put it there and then start making production here. I think that's what I'm going to do, but we'll keep on getting the research for the time being. Okay. Oh, there's a second one of these available supposedly. So there's a uh, scout guy and this one. 25% manufacturing 20. Yeah, I just don't think it's very good. I mean, some factories on their own are like that. That's one of the reasons why I don't think the citizens that give you a boost in a similar fashion. I mean, it's only 30%. It's not much. Buildings can do that. It should be raw production wide, then uh, percentage boost. Be much better. Okay. Um. Oh, yeah, this can get normal. Let's just go and grab some over here. Uh, colony ship. And stay over here, wait until I can get the range in the area. And some of these I may even upgrade. Well, if you want to know how you upgrade them, you come in here. All I'd have to do is find a. Uh, Right, hermit crab thing to upgrade there. That one's 66. So, if I can find uh, some good resources over here, I'll do that with one of them. Okay. Uh, so, uh, yeah, 13 colonies we got. It's not great, actually. I would have hoped for more than that. Could even conquer these miners. In fact, it's not a bad idea these days since they can't, can't trade with them anymore can't talk to them you might as well conquer them it's the only thing you can do now and their plants are going to be pretty good so this one is yeah two resources there you can see me maybe paying some miners a visit okay nothing there I mean, it's possible there might be something down here, like an extreme planet. I'm, yeah, we still haven't seen one, though. I'm pretty shocked by that. Uh, let come up here. An extreme planets have been within my starting system. Can, uh... Well, I think I'll pick up these anomalies near to uh, humans before they go get in. Uh, diplomacy, what are we looking like? They worry me actually, and maybe I should have got on open borders with them. Ah, I have a ship in the territory, that's not great. I'm going to give that to them for free. Okay. So, that should... Yeah, stop the rock. Okay, excellent. Uh, that... Let's come up here. Oh, I already had one over there. Right, not great. Uh, right, that was made recently. What else have I got? Right, I think I'm going to take a minute out to update some of these. Okay, for my colonies this turn, two of them I've just put on research aid because I'm not sure what I want to make on them. Yeah, I changed that legendary Marvin to legend as well, the name of it, and star. Uh, so yeah, uh, once I get that tile ability I'll know much more about how I'm going to specialise lens. 
Also going to make uh, yeah that crystallized Lindir this turn. Got tiny bits of movement left then, so got uh, survey down here, so that can come in this direction and cover some of the fog. They made the change actually to how the uh, fog looks and the tiles show up. I think I like it. Yeah, I prefer it to how it used to be. So let's keep on coming down there. Uh, right, this construct is done. So there's a Promethean and a Durantium over there. Ooh, that's actually next to Asteroid as well. But it's near to their borders and I don't want borders with them. So if I put yeah, that there, that would cause an issue and these guys are a bit of a threat actually. I want to keep them on side for a while. But I think I need to bring it over in that direction, that constructor, because I want to get a range over there. So I might not put it up there quite yet, but yeah, we're bringing it in that direction certainly. Okay. Uh, right, there's a idle ship there. Let's come down there, I guess. The shipyards that can make another constructor. Okay, I think that's yeah, making one as well. So we're starting on constructors now. I need more uh, admin definitely though so citizen in a couple of turns if I could get a lot of Promethean I could upgrade my existing ones to uh, well sacrifice them for more admin points which definitely might be worthwhile uh, let's come over here right that Another minor race, and that's it. Okay, uh, this colony ship then. Let's bring it up to there, I think. Might be able to get sight there eventually. Okay. I could probably add up all of the colony amounts and actually figure out how much is left to be colonized based on changing the map settings, but maybe I won't do that. Uh, right, so this colony. Uh, let's keep on scouting in the area. Nothing there. That's a disappointing. Nothing down here by the looks of it. Nothing that I can colonize anyway. Survey. Come up here. Could do with more of these, probably. Uh, right, I can come grab the space jump. a decent chance of flipping out. I should probably focus on influence on this world actually just to speed it along. Prevent them from doing it to me maybe. Okay. Right that got in position, let's anchor. <laughs> I think I might switch those over now, so that was making a survey. Uh, right, all of the Palver planets can go to there. I think we got the mission ability, didn't we? Recently. I think we did anyway. Yeah, it's a treasure hunt. Uh, this is subsidized as a private venture to unknown places to find 
and collect valuable artifacts as production for money. So if you like admin and don't want to make anything else, then yeah, this is a good option. Uh, 28 turns. 21 turns. Uh, should I build something else? Survey would take a long time. Yeah, I'll just do a treasure hunt here for the time being. Okay, I think I'll go with that. Which is. What? Ship construction? Not coming handy with a new starbase. That one. Is. Uh, gross income, more raw money. Where is this? Toria? Let's make a uh, hermit crab. We got one there. So, I think I was going to send it up here, extend my range up there, and get all of that really nice Promethium and Thulium. I think, well, basically, with star bases, they have a range of five, a standard, and there are some ways I think you can increase it. So, I think. Uh, well, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No, I can't get that and all of that. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Let's put it there, maybe. Thinking. Right. Uh, let's end the turn. I'll have to have a look in the bazaar in a minute again, see if I missed anything. I don't really pay an awful lot of attention to this, which maybe I should do the further I go into the game. Uh, right, new citizen available. Highly likely I'm going to be doing another admin. Uh, entrepreneur, if you're wondering, that's money. So that's social, that's science, that's money, and there's a lot more to come. Right. Uh, spies, I probably will have an interest in. Definitely will. But you, you can get free spies actually rather than using the 1 per 10 turns. And um, generals, commanders, wouldn't be surprised if I'll want to use. Okay. But uh, admin and leaders in the main. So that's kind of. Up here, do a bit of scouting. Well, that's an interesting place. Uh, if I can stick a constructor there, get two asteroids, two thulium, and a promethean. It's probably just about far away enough from them to cause avoid causing problems. Uh, yeah, let's come over there then. Right. Come down here. Nothing. Damn. And they colonized all of those. Let's then figure out where their capital is. Let's have a look around a bit. Yeah, maybe the capital's there, I'm guessing. That would make sense. That's why, yeah, I wouldn't be able to beat them. Down here. Nothing there. Okay. If I'm going to be sticking at Starbase here, let's make sure I get sight in the area a bit more, in case there's a better placement. Only ships in the area. Not picking up too much of those anomalies yet. Uh, let's come down to there. What's that? Construct there. 
That's not great. My Nick resource is off to be coming up. Uh, oh, I'm out of movement. Colony. I put the star port up there, did I? Probably want. Yeah, this place is a pain because I want research around here and I mainly want it for production since it's got that ruthless bonus. So. Uh, what am I going for? I'll stick that in the build list for the time being. Yeah, I'm not really sure when I'm doing a lot of these. Um, let's make. Let's make that. And that can make that. Toria out of admin. Right, let's. Uh, yeah, I want more constructors. Let's get the administrator. Okay. I've looked at everything down here, haven't I? So I should start coming back, look for resources. Um, there's a site there I could put it, grab that Prometheon, get three asteroids perhaps. to get a proper survey ship down here. Right, construct there. Okay, so yeah, with my placement here, I'm relics is priority I think first, then it's asteroids, and then it's various resources. Probably Promethean is the main resource I want followed by Durantium. You need Durantium to actually upgrade your star bases. Uh, there's asteroid there. So I could stick a star base there. Uh, is that near to it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ah, that is in range. But I could have star base there instead, maybe. Um. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's just that range. Those two are probably in range, though. Yeah, I might have a star base there, I'm thinking. Actually, I think if I pick. Yeah, if I get that within the star base's range, it will influence growth to there anyway, so I don't need to put it there, really. So I think I'll put one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Put it there. Grab that, grab that and that. Influence growth to there. I think. There's add oh that's a potentially amazing placement. Grabbing that. A lot of asteroids nearby. Okay, let's end a turn. Might. Oh, that's not good. Pirates. Okay. Well, let's view a battle, shall we? It's going to be a while before you see them. So you don't get any control about battles. I think Galaxy 3 is automatic. It's just a combat view to see how well you did. I hope we got an admin point back. I'm not sure you actually do. So that's quite costly, uh, to be honest. Wasting admin points like that. Wow, 14 pirates. Bloody hell. Okay. Let's 
bound to run into some eventually. Uh, right, we've got a planetary soil upgrade. That's crucial. That will help me a huge amount in planning out my colonies. So, I'm also going to want to go after the food, though. We want that pretty soon as well. But we'll come up here now to grab the food. Which is going to take a while, by the looks of it. Yeah, it takes a real long time, actually, to get food. Which is a problem. Let's grab that. Uh... This, even though it's got weapons, it won't be able to take that on. Let's come over, well, come away from it. Thought I was going to put a star base over there as well, wasn't I? Might not be such a great idea then. Oh, that's Celtarians actually, not pirates. Okay. Uh, where was I? Yeah, I was bringing that up there. Well, let's for yeah, let's forget about that. I'll actually put that there now and then uh, upgrade it straight away because it's kind of really good. I want to get it sooner rather than later. Right. Let's go do some scouting in the area. There's an asteroid there. try and keep out of the territory. Uh, so, yeah, Altarians are not going to be able to do anything about. The others I might be able to do something about. Keeping their relations from going down. Uh, let's talk to the Yor. Did you give me anything for that? I'll give uh, an open border treaty with these guys as well. Okay. Right. Right, nothing there. No surprises. That's got to be where this started now. So, that is a lot nearer to them than it is to my capital. I mean, if I rushed down there, I could have beaten them to it, probably. Uh, maybe could have gotten these if I'd sent colonies out there earlier. Uh, yeah, there's maybe a few more colonies I could have picked up here if I'd have been a bit more lucky or sent them in certain directions. But didn't do it too badly on the colonizing phase, I'd say. Uh, right, let's come up here. And, uh, oh, map movement. Let's survey ship. Let's get, ooh, artifact. Uh, that's the nearest colony. I'm going to put that in the list there. Let's hope we get a free building. I'll get that for free. Could happen. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. Uh, that was good planning, wasn't it? I just got that for free. So, uh, brilliant. Uh, Galactic Intelligent Agency. It's a research improvement that uh, you only get yeah, one per galaxy, and it provides a free spy upon completion. So I put it on a tile in the middle of nowhere, which, uh, yeah, good placement. And, uh, well, we now have espionage. So who the hell do I want to do this on? Altarian, should we do it on? So, uh, let's stick it there, is it? I could have it preventing, well, providing security for me, but there's not much point, I doubt anyone spying on me. I think we'd know actually, it would show up. Build buildings would have uh, no output on it and it would tell me. 
Okay, that was great then. That's, so that's what you can achieve if you basically uh, plan things correctly. And yeah, you could also micromanage your research as well for really expensive techs if you're so inclined. Okay. Right. Right, the colony. Uh, is there anything in here that I... Oh. Yeah, I'm going to have to start looking around my plant section, seeing where these can be placed so I can uh, figure them out in a minute. So, I'll be coming back to them shortly. Let's get another survey ship out. Could definitely afford more constructors. I've got five out there somewhere, though, supposedly. I'm definitely going to be turning some of those colony ships into constructors as well. Uh... Right, let's get, yeah, we'll get another survey out there. Eight turns, that's a long time. Hmm, might change that in a minute. Okay. Two constructors there, constructor there. That can come down and here. Okay, I'm going to take a minute out then to uh, plan up my colonies, most of their specialization I think. So at that point I actually stopped recording for the day and it's been a number of developments since I last recorded. There's been a couple of hot fixes come out for Galsa 3 Crusades and even a new patch. It's in opt-in on Steam currently so it's not fully widely available but yeah there's uh, basically been a lot going on. Now the problem is with the initial release version of the game which I was playing uh, there's a number of bugs in that version and if I were to try to continue on with that let's play well uh, bugs would still exist uh, basically the patch wouldn't overwrite uh, existing issues uh, for instance there was supposedly a bug to do with farms with the aquatic races i.e. the Torians and custom races so I'm not sure I would even be able to build farms because the initial one is missing, supposedly. And it's been a huge amount of changes actually in this patch. Surprisingly, there's been quite a few tech changes, lots of bug fixes. There's still a lot more fixes that are actually needed, but yeah, I think it's going to be pretty much impossible for me to continue on with this Let's Play, it would seem. Which I'm pretty annoyed at actually because it's been doing very well in likes and views and I'm very grateful to you for that. It's been going great but uh, yeah I think I'm going to have to call it an end at this point. But I am planning on doing another Let's Play. I'm going to get it out uh, maybe a day after this video comes out too possibly. Uh, I think that's what I'm going to do. I could go back to Solaris but... Uh, yeah, it seems people want to see Galsa 3 at the moment. So, yeah, I'm planning another Let's Play. And, uh, yeah, make sure you check that out. It's, uh, yeah, as I mentioned, really annoying that I'm not going to be able to continue on this Let's Play. But I don't really see another option, to be honest. So, that's it then for this video and this Let's Play. So, thank you for watching. And I'll hope to see you next time for the next Let's Play.